Art, of course, is the only language we have that really does make sense of the universe. And it helps us to praise the world. And it helps us to understand the nature of the one thing that we all need, uh, uh, and without it we go mad, uh, which is beauty. Everything that is worthwhile in this world made by man is inevitably asking us to define it as beautiful. The exhibition has at its heart um, the art of the filmmaker. It's relating to the, the National Film School in Poland. The whole room is set up so that you can see these cases of work by students and teachers here in relation to the students and teachers associated with the film school in Łódź. Łódź means boat, L-O-D-Z in Polish. You can study aspects of Shakespeare from this. You can study the plans to develop this part of North Edinburgh in that map. I love this artist's work. This artist is from the city of Łódź and she is making a, t a statement about the high-rise buildings and the, um, the, if you like, the chimneys of what was one of the world's greatest manufacturing cities. This is the work of an artist who happens to teach here, um, Neil Manning, a very fine sculptor, as you can see. As you go down, you come across another uh, art uh, teacher here, Neil Russell. And he is an important artist who is capable of making uh, a statement about the nature of love. A very personal statement. Now I hope everybody's listening. This man, Joseph Boyce, is the was the 20th century equivalent of Leonardo da Vinci. And I'm not the only one who thought that. And this image here is extremely important. The one of Boyce looking straight out ahead. And he is there portrayed as a teacher as well as an artist. He was the first artist of the 21st century. So what does that mean? Boyce is someone who said that the, the theory of money as the bloodstream of society has to be really seriously rethought because it's not working and it's going to destroy society. You've seen that in 1980. How do you think I feel? You know what he said? My art is all about my life of work as a teacher. He also said, everyone is an artist.